You actually managed to find this place. Congratulations. So, you're another Fatui Harbinger? Like Senora and Child? Senora and Child. <laughs> I didn't know you and my two least reliable colleagues were acquainted. I'm the Balladeer. Number six of the Fatui Harbingers. Delighted to meet you, oh mighty traveler. So many visitors today. To what do I owe the honor? Oh, so that's what this is about. I think you've got the wrong idea. I know how this looks, but I'm just here to follow orders. I'm obviously not the mastermind behind this. Aren't you supposed to be pretty tough? What are you waiting for? Go get them. You're getting all worked up over nothing. <sighs> Didn't have you down as being so weak. How can you say this is nothing? How can you call it anything more? It's the way of the world. Human life is worthless. They were always going to die, with or without a delusion. At least having one gives them a chance to fulfill their ambitions. Do you have any idea how useful the Vision Hunt decree is to us? It took a lot of work to make it happen. Obviously, it was in our best interests. Good news is, our hard work is finally paying off. Generating conflict creates a big market for delusions. Now we just let the promise of power draw in the weak. For just a small price, they get the feeling of controlling the world. Trading their life for supreme power. Pretty good deal, don't you think? So... The Fatui started the Vision Hunt Decree? You've been behind it all along? From the outside, Inazuma looks pretty impenetrable. But on the inside, it's a land of opportunity. With a little effort, we were able to break them down from within. Eternity stretches things out over a long time. But each moment within it becomes all the more fragile. Take your friend in the Resistance, for example. There's nothing you can do now. He's a lost cause. Just like a bubble on the water. Beautiful for a moment, then total destruction. The more it takes from them, the more tightly they hold on to it. And the more incompetent they are, the more determined they are to fight it. <laughs> it's such a farce. You have to see the funny side. <laughs> That's it. Just like that. Embrace the anger. Embrace it! The wrath of the gods fills this factory, and it feeds on your anger. <laughs> uh, what's happening? Get up! Repeat after me. Three, two, one. One, two, three. <sighs> Come on. Okay, that's positive. Your brain seems relatively unscathed. This is good news. <laughs> 